We're still covering breaking news of a shooting at Lamar and Winchester. An officer has been hit from what we understand. As a matter of fact, this is a look at the ambulance entrance, a live look at Regional One Hospital. As you see, several officers have gathered there uh, to support their, uh, their injured fellow officer. It's my understanding Fox 13's Kayla Solomon is there live right now. Do we want to go straight to Kayla or is she still gathering information? Okay, she's well, there's getting There's a lot set. that we're trying to figure out, trying to figure exactly what led to all of this. We don't know the extent of the injuries mm -hmm. of the officer. We don't know if someone else was involved in this. So there's a lot more information that we are gathering right now as police are out there, of course, working this investigation. As a matter of fact, we're getting word now that Kayla is ready. Kayla, what can you tell us? I know you just saw a whole uh, caravan, I guess, of, of officers making their way to the hospital. Daryl, we just got to the scene about 10 minutes ago and it was quiet around here. We did not hear any sirens, none of that. But then just minutes ago, not even five minutes ago, that all changed. We saw a whole line of Memphis police cars. They had the sirens blaring. There was an ambulance leading the charger that pulled into the driveway here at Regional One very quickly to get that police officer inside. As you mentioned, we don't know the condition of that officer, but at this time we do know that it happened in the OK neighborhood will be standing by here outside regional one for any updates that we can get but for right now all we know is that an officer was shot brought here to regional one just minutes ago there's a whole hospital is swarming with officers at this point trying to block off the scene if you're trying to get anywhere around the medical district right now all the intersections are closed off around regional one back to you Kayla, really quick before you go, it was my understanding that someone else might have been hit as well. Maybe a perpetrator, maybe not. But have you seen a second ambulance by any chance? At this point, we've only seen one ambulance pulled in. Again, that ambulance was followed by a bunch of police cars. But no, we've only seen one ambulance.